This video will show you how to find good quality images online and how to add a video to your Microsoft Sway. You can use Sway to bring together materials for any online presentation, like an article or a learning module. My Sway is on mindfulness and how it can help reduce stress in the workplace. I need some good images to grab the reader's attention and really bring my topic to life. There are sites online where you can get free, high quality images that you can use without breaching copyright. The first one I want to show you is unsplash.com. I usually just dive in and start searching, but I just noticed that there's a health and wellness category here at the top. So I think I'll open that in a new tab and take a look. Straight away, I can see that there are some great images here for my sway. This image is really eye catching because it's colorful and it conveys a strong idea. I'm going to grab it for my sway. Notice that when I select it, Unsplash shows me related images underneath, which is helpful. I'm going to click on download and save this image in my project folder. When you download, you get this pop up, which conveniently gives you information about who authored the image. It's good practice to grab these and put them in a word file so you can attribute your images properly when you put them in Sway. Let's talk for a moment about effective searching. Sites like Unsplash are not like journals databases. They won't allow you to get too specific with search terms, so you need to hunt a bit. The trick is to keep trying and keep finding different ways to describe what you want using a combination of ideas and literal images. I've also found a video on YouTube that I want to include in my Sway. Rather than just pasting a link, I want the video to play in the Sway, so I need the embed code. To find this code, click on Share, then select Embed. I'm going to copy that code and head over to Sway. I click to add and then select Media. It seems logical to click on Video but this button is for embedding an MP4 file, which you may need to do if you make your own video. I'm just linking someone else's content, so I need the embed card. Once that card pops up, just paste your code. Let's go into play mode and see how that looks. So you can see my video is in there now and it plays in this way. Remember, there are other things beside video that you can embed. I found this story about mindfulness on Facebook and after a bit of clicking around, I realized that the embed link is in this breadcrumb. Remember, you're looking for an iframe code. Once you've found it, just copy it and put it in an embed card in your Sway. If Sway doesn't support an embed code from the tool you've chosen, it will tell you. For a full list of the tools and products that you can embed in Sways, go to the link I've provided in the description for this video. Now take a look while I add some of my own written content and some of the images I found earlier.